What's up guys? Doing a quick workout in my garage and I got a few questions about what the difference should be in terms of form when it comes to a dead ball slam versus dead ball rebounds, okay? Um, and real quickly, the gist of it is basically hips and arm drive. So with a dead ball slam, we wanna keep the arms as straight as possible and as those arms are coming down, the hips are going to hinge back, relatively straight legs, slight bend in the knee, but nothing drastic, because we're not worried about bending down to get that ball off the rebound. So a dead ball slam should look something like this. Slow and controlled coming up, fully extended overhead, drive those arms as those hips come back, and try to make that ball pop as loud as possible. If the hips are coming back enough, we should get some nice English on that ball so it rolls right back into your stance. One more time. Okay, so really focusing on the power, using that lat activation, straight arms, hips come back. For a dead ball rebound, we're okay dropping that chest a little bit more, bending those knees so we can catch it off of the bounce, off of the rebound, and get right back up. Rebounds, more for cardio, um, metabolic conditioning, slams more for power output. So a rebound should look something like this. So notice I get much lower. All right, so one more time real quick, the difference between the two. Dead ball slam. Dead ball rebound. Hope you guys' Thursday is going well. Get out and work out.